Hello, North Star. This is Mrs. Hathaway again. I wanted to show you how to get into your child's Benchmark Universe Reading Library. There will be books assigned here by your teacher. Please be patient if there's not much there yet. It's new to our teachers as well, and teachers are working hard to get some assignments made of the current unit that we're working in in Benchmark or any relevant materials. To access it, you do have to log in to my.aps.edu. Both of these links on our resource tab go to my.aps.edu because you have to log in first there. You will use your student ID, which is the 9800 number, followed by your password, which is your initials dot birth date. So I will do that quickly. It takes it just a second to log in. And then at the very top, the very second icon should be this benchmark universe. Right there, it looks like the planet of Saturn. If you pick on that, it takes you right into your child's dashboard. We call it a dashboard because it's where they find all of the resources available to them. The books that get assigned to them in Benchmark are called assignments. Let me turn on my little spotlighter again and it will soon show us the list of assignments. Here we go. So I've logged in as one of my students and here she has many assignments because I've kind of opened up this library to my class. It's something that my class has been using all year. So mine might look a little different than the one your teacher has for you. Right here is the current unit we're working on for unit seven eBooks. If you pick on that, it gives you an entire list of reading materials. It shows whether they've been opened, done, reviewed and all of the material list here. It talks about what type they are. These are eBooks. And over here on the status, it shows if they have been read or not. So on any of these books, in order to load one, you just simply pick on this little book icon here. When you hover your mouse over it, it turns bright blue, so you can pick on it and it will open the book. You can read it yourself, you can have the machine read it to you, um, or you could turn the pages manually on your own as well. I will show you how to do all of that with my handy spotlight tool. Right here at the top, it has a play button. When you pick that, it starts reading the book. This auto button will also turn the pages for you automatically. So I'll show you what it looks like. Benchmark Education Company proudly presents Phonics Decodable Readers. Follow along as I read. When you hear this sound, turn the page. Phonics Decodable Readers Toad and His Boat by Pamela Walker Illustrated by Juan Bautista Juan Oliver To turn the page, you just hover over and that little page looks like Toad it turns. Toad and His Boat by Pamela Walker so you get the idea of how to read. When you're finished reading a book, you can just close this window and it takes you right back to your activities. And you notice that it now has a timestamp on here that this person has spent some time reading this book. If it was finished, it would be green or this would have a check mark in it over here under done. To access other activities, just close this box and you can go to other things like uh, maybe your teacher assigned some Heidi songs. These are little videos that play. And again, just pick on this open book to play it. And to close it, just go back through that same way. You'll want to be sure to check resources because there'll be lots of fun things here for your child to do. So this is an example of a Heidi song. F O R four. So I'll pause that. And again, you can close this and close this if you want to get back to your list of activities. If you're all finished for the day, be sure you sign out. Go to this top button and hit the sign out button. And again, also, especially if you're sharing this device with other family members, you're gonna to want to sign out of my.aps.edu. I wanted to show you this screen as well because if you try to sign into Benchmark Universe from this page, it will not let you. You will have to try this class link and it might take you back um, and see if that works. But always access Benchmark through the my.aps.edu. I hope this helps you with all of your at-home learning and you'll be able to have a home library this way. Thank you so much. Good luck, North Star.